I got nothing. Hey guys, I just went and saw The Pyramid. Yeah, The Pyramid is a horror film from 2013 made by, you guessed it, 20th Century Fox. And, oh Jesus. I mean seriously, like I've seen this movie before, like I've seen trailers for it and stuff, and I was like, yeah, it looks like it could be a pretty minuscule fu fun time. That was... I was so wrong. Seriously. Like, guys, guys, I'm not even fucking with you at this point. This is probably one of the dumbest horror movies I've ever seen in my life. But let's get to it anyway, because you need to know how stupid this was. Okay, so this movie is basically, and I mean basic, basic, basically about some dumb archaeologists who go into this dumb pyramid to find, I, I don't know, nothing. They just want to go inside and look. Literally. Literally, they are window shopping, and then they get trapped in there. They get trapped window shopping in a pyramid. Well, there is a reason. Their camera got stuck in there. This is the only reason they went back in there. I would have said, fuck the camera. I'll go buy a new one. But anyway, it stars his daughter and, his, and her father, who are like a team of archaeologists, and there's like a couple other people that go down there. And then it's like the dad is like the most gullible person. I have ever met in my life. Seriously, this dude is so... Like, he gives into the daughter so much. It's insane. Like, you will literally... Like, he'll be like, Oh, we can't go down in that pyramid. We'll die down there. But, Dad, it could further advance our career. Well, I can't disagree with you, honey. Or, Dad, we need to go find where our friends are. Oh, we can't. They're probably dead. But, Dad, they might not be. Well, you're right. They might not be. Literally, this guy gives in to every little thing that she says, and it's insane. The, the, fuck, oh my god, seriously, like, the people die in this movie in such stupid ways. Okay, so there's this one part where they're running through a sand trap, and this chick is running, and then she stops, because it's like, whoa, there's metal spikes down there, glad I didn't land on those. Then she turns around and sees that this guy's coming toward her, and then he's, like, going like this, but then he stops. And then she goes, oh, you came too close. And then she flies back and lands on the spikes and dies. <laughs> Fuck. Seriously. Like, that, if I came running at you but stopped, like, 50 feet in front of you, would that make you go, whoa, and then fly back? No, it wouldn't make you do that. That's, that's stupid. And then another thing happens in this movie. Like, a, they fall through this, like, floor and whatnot. That's Because it's old floor, you fall through it whatnot. And this dude's standing there talking, and all of a sudden a rock falls on him. I'm like, oh, that dude smashed his crap. But literally, anyway, due to this fact, like, the rock falls on him. Seriously, the rock falls on him. Like, if he is right, look at This is him, this is a rock. That didn't happen. It fell on his leg. I can, I, I'm sorry, a rock lands on your head, and somehow it ended up in your leg. Did he have time to, like, go, oh, that rock's right on top of my head. Better move a little out of the way. But anyway, something dragged him away. And the thing that you think in this movie, it's like, okay, they're in a pyramid. They're obviously being chased by a mummy. It's, it's not, it's not a mummy. It's not, <laughs> it's not a mummy. It is, I don't, I don't even know how to explain it. Seriously, this, they're being hunted by cats and a giant dog. <laughs> they should have called it Cat Dog, the movie. Because seriously... What? Oh my god. I'm, I'm sorry. It's just, it's dumb. Anyway, there's cats chasing them throughout the land. The cats aren't that dangerous because they're like these skinny little things that go, you know, and whatnot. And then they're also getting attacked by this disease, apparently. Apparently, if you're not pure of heart, you get attacked by this disease that slowly attacks your eyesight and hearing and taste, whatever, all that. And then it's like this girl is completely, like, immune to this disease, right? Completely immune to this disease. And then all of a sudden, by the end, she, she has it, 
right as she escapes. Isn't that, isn't that suck? It's like The Ruins. <laughs> Literally, this movie reminds me of The Ruins. It's another horror movie where it's like everyone dies from this stupid plant disease and then one chick gets out and it's like, oh, oh big surprise, she's got it too. Because, oh my god. Fuck. I gotta talk about the villain from this movie. Because seriously, the, the villain is Anubis. Seriously, the villain is Anubis. You know who Anubis is? He's like the big dog god of Egypt or whatnot. He looks like he just stepped out of a CGI cartoon on the CW show. Seriously. That's what he looks like. Like when he was farther away in night vision, he looked scary. He looked real. In CG, no. He looked terrible. He looked—he literally looked like a cartoon dog that you probably could have threw on Nickelodeon. The cats on the ground look more real than him. But the funniest part of this movie is that you, this one dude literally tells you guys that he's going to die. Because it's like, okay, we got to climb up this ladder to get out. Okay, here, you hold the important camera, and I'll walk up the ladder second. It's like, you just basically told us you're going to die. And guess what? Ten seconds later, dead. And Anubis grabs him on the ladder, and he's dead. But the funny part about this is that she gets to the top and then dragged down, and then the movie fades to dark. And I'm like, okay. The movie's over? Okay, that was terrible. And then all of a sudden it comes back, and I'm like, okay, that wasn't the end of the movie? Oh, I guess we got more to go. Apparently, and she's tied up by Anubis, right? Trying to, t He's trying to take her heart, and then she escapes again, and then she gets to the top, gets to the light, gets out of the pyramid, and then it fades to black, and I'm like, okay, little butter. Then it comes back. It's seriously, like, this movie ended twice, and then it's like, okay... One more time. So she gets to the top and she's like, oh god, I gotta get out of here. And you can't see this side of her face because that's the side of the face with a disease on it. It's